um, this is a okay, chiffon, nice. and uh, it is pretty. I folded it several times in here, so that's why it's so thick. Um, it will soak up dye mainly on the surface at first, but um, this is going to be interesting. The way this looks, I think I will have a pattern that maybe I'm not too happy with. So what I'll do is I apply it differently than what I usually would. Would you hand me a um, paper towel, please, if you can, with that one hand? Thank you. <clears throat> I just realized there is something in my... Sorry. There is something in my dye that... I do not want to have sitting on there. This is actually against my usual application. I go straight down. I go straight down the way the pipe runs. But here, I feel that I should take into consideration the way I, the way I tied my silk onto the tube. All right. And here I do it straight across from which way? I tied it on. Okay, this is my first application. It'll have to go through all the layers. do is this here oh I thought this was a brown maybe it isn't but that's all right now are you leaving white space in between um well sort of I wanted to blend but um, What I will do is I add some water in the end and here I actually go into the red because I want a third color. So I do want a combination of this gray and red. And after all, we're playing here. Nothing has to be a certain way. I choose this to be blending and yes I will have some I will leave some white I do want my tip to have color, so that's why I'm going over with this red again. There is sort of an empty spot. As this is a um, chiffon, it drinks up the dye differently than if it were um, a habotai, which is a smooth, a smooth weave. I do want to make sure that the edges have color. If I neglect that, um, I have noticed that it leaves sort of ugly, unfinished areas. 
And here I can tell the black is already seeping into the red, which is fine. And this is another little, oh, whatever got in here. All right. Oops. And this happens when you don't pay attention. I accidentally picked up some of um, some of the black. want to make this black a little stronger and now it really just drinks it up all right in order to make it blend a little better I will spray it with some water. Mm, can anyone hand me the... Thank you. Now it turns brownish. That's what I thought the color was. By adding pure water, I push the dye deeper into my folds while helping it to blend. It is my intention not to have a sharp color color um, separation. And I do have some white, which I'm afraid is going to be too much white. So I will just add a little more dye out of the... Okay, 